Today we're going to be reading The Color Factory by Eric Telchin and illustrated by Diego Funk. You might be required to rub, tilt, and shake this book. Read to you by your librarian, Mrs. Roach. Hello and welcome to the grand opening of The Color Factory. We'd like to bring you inside for a very special tour. And please remember, look around because there's factory approved colors everywhere. We create colors here. We use very strict formulas so we can make these colors perfect. Once the colors are approved, we apply them to all sorts of things. We also make books. In fact, the book you're reading right now is filled with factory approved colors. Simply turn the page and we'll start the tour. Perfect Color Replicator Machine allows us to calculate an object's exact color ingredients. For example, we just matched the color of this chocolate bar to make factory approved chocolate brown. And remember those fast growing rose seeds? Well, they certainly did grow fast. We're copying their color to make factory approved rose. Next, we're going to create factory approved orange. You can probably guess how we're going to do that. That's right, factory approved orange is made from fire engine red and canary yellow. Now that's the perfect color replicator has matched these two colors. We just need to mix them together. Can you help us? Simply tap each color once, then press this button, please. Perfect, great job, we approve. The formula for factory approved orange works every time. That's because our formulas are perfect because our colors are perfect. Now let's move on to the creature colorization room. This egg needs to be colored with factory approved Robin's egg blue. But first we need to mix that color. Simply follow the formula from the color manual. Three taps of factory approved sky blue, a quick rub of the factory approved grass green, and a squiggle of factory approved cloud white. Use your finger to tap, rub, and squiggle, then Press this button. It's perfect! We approve. But we have so much more to show you. Let's go to the confectionery room. The confectionery room is the most colorful, most delicious, most perfect room in the whole color factory. But we have treats that still need to be colored. Could you help us? Since you're doing such a perfect job, we'd like you to color this lollipop. Use your finger to pull factory approved Robin's egg blue onto it and drag some factory approved cotton candy pink too. Be careful not to mix the colors as you apply them to the lollipop. This is very important. Uh, um, this color's not in the color manual. It's not a factory approved color. We do not approve. You have to help us remove this color from the factory. Please rub the color off the page. <laughs> rub, rub, rub. Now it's worse. This non-factory approved color is changing everything. Oh no. Don't worry. The color manual will tell us what to do. Color manual index. Press here for instructions. Quick, press the button. Instructions for cleaning non-factory approved colors from the color factory. You're in big trouble. To remove non-factory approved colors from the factory, you had better ask someone for help. S-O-S. -S. You, reader, please help us. Can you inhale, breathe in as much color as possible? We need to get this non-factory approved color out of the factory. On the count of three, take a deep breath. Ready? One, two, three. Wait, that was too deep a breath. You removed all the colors from the factory. How can we get the factory approved colors back? The color manual will tell us. Adding color to the color factory. If you removed factory approved colors from the color factory, you're in big, big trouble. You better ask someone for help. Reader. Can we have our colors back, please? Simply blow the colors back on the page, but please bring only the factory approved colors back. 
uh-oh. Now there are even more non-factory approved colors. Not approved. Well, we'll have to check the color manual again. Instructions, cleaning non-factory approved colors from the color factory. This is the last option. You're really in big trouble now. Shake the color out of the factory. Shake the book to remove the non-factory approved colors. Go on, jiggle it. I hope this works. It's our last option. This still isn't right, but that was our last option. What does the color manual say? I told you, you're in big trouble. There are no options left. You must close the color factory. Close the color factory forever? That's what the color manual says. Peter, please push the button and shut the factory's power off. I can't look. No more wonderful colors. No more colorful creations. Whoa, look at these. We've created neon colors, but they're not factory approved. Who cares? They're perfect. Let's approve them all. Yay! So many wonderful colors and creations. They're amazing, cool. Reader, turn the power back on. Now we don't need to close the color factory. These colors are factory approved. New color factory, well, almost. And that's perfectly fine with us. We approve. <laughs> Thanks for reading The Color Factory by Eric Telchin and read to you by your librarian, Mrs. Roach. And always remember, hashtag PPS Reads. <laughs>